Today I'm recording using my iPhone as a web camera. I cannot believe how amazing this looks. Why didn't I think of this? If you wanna use your iPhone as a webcam, this is the video to watch. Plus this app just launched a brand new feature that you're gonna to wanna to know about. Let's check it out together. I'm Phil Pallon, a brand strategist. Welcome to my channel where I share practical advice to build your brand. Today I'm in Lisbon, Portugal, and as someone who is constantly traveling with minimal room for gear in my suitcase, I am loving and excited to share camo. I partnered up with Reincubate, the company that created it. We've teamed up for this video to explore how well an iPhone can work as a webcam. Spoiler, it works really well. This solution is so much better than the webcam you have built into your computer. I'm actually gonna show you a comparison. This is how it looks when I use the webcam built into my computer. Pretty standard, not that impressive, but it's most people's go-to for their Zoom calls or any other conferencing call. And here's how it looks when I use Camo. This app is impressive, beautiful 1080p resolution, super high res, and not only does it look great, but you're gonna be impressed by all of these controls that I'm gonna walk you through in a moment. Camo also launched a brand new feature called Snap, and I'm gonna show you that up close. You're going to love this. Let's check it out. Okay, here I am inside the app. The first thing I wanna show you, look left and right, you'll see a whole bunch of hardware and software settings. So you're gonna have total control over absolutely everything. Things like lenses, lighting, colors, zooms, crop, and focus. You can adjust all of these without having to touch your iPhone. I'll show you a few of these on our camera settings. Let's start by looking at the lens. I'm showing why, but it could also be ultra wide, depending on what you're using for your iPhone. I'll go back to wide. I can also switch the camera to the selfie camera, depending on how I have my iPhone set up. And if for any reason I needed to change the resolution, I could do that here, but obviously I'm gonna leave it at 1080p for this high quality. If I wanted to adjust lighting or other settings, I would go over here on the right. I'm gonna leave those for now. What I am gonna show you is super exciting. These are the new snap features, which I was talking about under mode. When I click there, default set to normal, you're gonna see a whole bunch of new settings and I'm gonna go through them right now. Let's start with portrait mode. You might be familiar with this on your iPhone. Well, now you can have it as a webcam setting. And if I skip down to options under accessibility, the first one I'm gonna show you is emoji face. It literally puts an emoji over my face and it animates it depending on what I'm doing with my face. But not just emoji face, also emoji hands. And notice the emoji actually moves with my hand. This is another really cool setting called face follow and it means the camera will actually move as I move my face. Now under masking, we'll start with invisible where literally I become invisible. All you see are my eyes and my mouth. The next setting is beauty, which adds a nice filter. I am benefiting from that filter today. I'll show you a few more, including 8-bit, which takes this and makes it look vintage. Finally, under this category, this is called sketch. Now a few more under novelty, and I'll move quickly through these. Chromatic. This setting is called the starry night. Lightning. Big head, and that is exactly what this is, a big head. And this one's called Fred's on your head. And literally there is a cat on my head. And beyond having a lot of fun in this app with the new Snap feature, this app is awesome. It will work with Skype, Zoom, Meetings, Slack, Google Chrome, Cisco, WebEx, and other video conferencing software. No need to run any special commands to make it work. Also, might I add, it was so easy to get this working. First, you install the app on your iPhone, and then whether you're using Windows or Mac, you just install the desktop suite, and it will work right away, plug and play. No drivers or anything complicated to mess around with. Finally, you can't see it now because I'm full screen in the app, but it will also give you a resizable preview window, which is really awesome because some apps don't give you that. You are going to love, love, love this app. So there you go, that's Camo, an app that you can grab to turn your iPhone into a high quality webcam. And with this new feature, Snap, I am so 
totally impressed. I'm going to link to the app below. Go ahead and check it out for yourself. If you've got any lingering questions, go ahead and comment those below. Let's keep the conversation going on down there and I respond to those personally. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like. That helps other people discover these videos, which we work hard to create for you. And subscribe for more of my videos on branding, positioning, building, and promoting your brand. I love this tool. A huge thanks to Reincubate for this partnership. Next, I'm sharing through a few videos I think you'll be interested in. I'm Phil Palin. Thanks for watching, and those videos are coming up next. Thank you.